Hello, this is Ankit Tyagi from Raj Lakshmi Samvid Gurukulam Sainik School, Nalagarh, Himachal Pradesh. I have prepared this video for IITE Gandhinagar Teachers Training Program Vastavit. The title of my video is India Many Tastes, One Thali. But the essence unity in diversity i am here to present a panoramic view to india's heritage of cuisines and you will observe diversity of variety but a unity of sumptuous spicy taste so welcome to the further destinations India. India is a country, a huge country of various tastes and cuisines. It is a huge country. Many geographic regions are there. Many climates, people, languages and dialects are there. In the same way, to fulfill, to prove India's diversity, many cereals, fruits, vegetables, spices, cuisines, and even tastes are found in India. First, let's see about what type of food people prefer. Most, uh, much of India prefer vegetarian food. Many of people are also like to eat vegetarian food along with non-vegetarian food but there are many places as well many states as well where people like non-vegetarian food much more even we can say that non-vegetarian food makes their diet the most whereas people like People are completely vegetarian in place like Rajasthan. They might be completely non-veg in place like no, uh, places of North, North East, Arunachal, Nag Arunachal, Nagaland, Odisha, Bengal, Andhra Pradesh, in Ladakh. In places like Ladakh, they are they eat both of them. Whereas in places like Uttar Pradesh and Madhya Pradesh and Gujarat, people like mostly the non-vegetarian food, but somehow they also like non-vegetarian as well. Let's move ahead. And now I must say that I would like to draw your attention to the vegetarian foods only. So first we shall take you to the fields of agriculture. In India, we grow rice, wheat, jowar, bajra and much more. These are the food grains grown here. Whereas wheat is really very important play cereal. Then comes to dal. Dal pulses. Pulses all make a very important part of our diet. From green mutter dal of Kashmir. Rajma of Kashmir, Sabut Urad of Uttarakhand, White Rajma, Kulak Dal, Chickpeas of Uttar Pradesh, Chana Dal of Uttar Pradesh, Madhya Pradesh comes with Masur Dal, Black Rice, Moong Sabut, Adhar Dal from Maharashtra, Urad Whole White, Lobia from Tamil Nadu, Chilka Urad, Urad Dhali, from Odisha and Andhra Pradesh, Masri Dal, Masul Sabut, 
and much more. These are the pulses here. Besides this, we have various types of rice as well. Red rice, rice bean, brown, brown rice, black rice, ambe mohar rice in Maharashtra, bamboo rice, ponni rice in Tamil Nadu, white rice, dubraj rice and much more. But this is not the limit. Here we have something more. We say that we know that since the ancient times, India has been the cradle of spices. The foreigners have been attracted to the Indian lands for exotic spices. The spices not only increase the taste of the dish, they also have medicinal or we, I can say medical significance. Let's see. Oregano which helps to smooth stomach muscles, mint, which can ease hiccups, ginger is an anti-nausea remedy, turmeric, which is anti-cancer, saline, it can stop a heart attack, cinnamon, cinnamon, which helps to reduce blood pressure, then rosemary, sage, clove, which is an antimicrobial fennel, fenugreek, which helps to flush out harmful toxins from the body. And now, let's see. The various other spices, which Spices are grown in which part of India? Oregano and saffron in Kashmir, red chili powder, rosemary in Kashmir as well, asphatida, heem in uh, Punjab region of India, pink rocks, rock salt, jakhia in Uttar Pradesh and Uttarakhand, bhang jeera in Uttar Pradesh, black cinnamon, flax seeds and coriander seeds in Madhya Pradesh, Kamarkas, cumin seeds in Rajasthan, basil in Maharashtra, black pepper, nutmeg, cinnamon white, whole powder and turmeric powder in Odisha. Cloves is also found in South India. You know, various, uh, various traders and explorers came to landed in South India only and their main at the main source of attraction for them was the spice were the spices in which black pepper, green cardamom, and turmeric and cloves were the main. But and now let's come to the Fruit map of India. See how many fruits are there. Mangoes, plum, oranges, lychees, malta from Himachal, cherry from Himachal, lychee from Dehradun as well. It is not mentioned here, but lychee is in there. Shahi lychee from Bihar and Muzaffarpur. Muzaffarpur's lychee, then Mosambi, Mati banana, Nasik's grapes, and Nagpur's oranges, Kesar from Kil mango, Ganganagar Kino, Allahabad ka Sulk Gawawa, Abohar Kino, that is in Hindi we call it Kino, Kashmiri golden apple, and Himachali royal delicious apple. Much of it is there. Much, many fruits we can find in India. And now, let's come to the king of the fruits. The favorite of every Indian, mango. You can see how many types of mangoes are grown. And it, uh, though it is said that around 700 types of mangoes are grown in India, among which Famous are Bombay Green, 
Chausa, Dasheri, and Langada from Uttar Pradesh, Himachal Pradesh, and Haryana. Chausa is grown in many states. Uh, Uttar, like Uttar Pradesh, Himachal, Punjab, Haryana. and Bihar, whereas Gujarat and Maharashtra have very famous mango named Alfonso, which is grown in Madhya Pradesh as well, along with Tamil Nadu. In Karnataka, there is Totapuri Aam, which is very famous, Neelam, Mulgoa, Mango, Rajasthan, which has green, Bombay green mango and Langada, um, along with the shahari. In West Bengal also mangoes are grown and the types there famous there are Fazli, Gulbakhas, Himsagar, Kishanbhog, Langada and Bombay Green. So we can say these are the just first few types of mangoes. But this is not just one thing. Now come to the cuisines of India, which are many. Jammu Kashmir's Kustaba, Tabak, Himachal Pradesh. Pradesh has Sidhu, Dham. Punjab has Dal Makhani, Chole Bhature, Makke Di Roti, Salsuda Saag. Haryana has Rabadi, Bajre Di Khichdi. Delhi comes with Chaat, Tandoori Chicken and Chole Bhature. I know if you have been to Delhi, you must have found you must have gone to Chandni Chowk, Chandni Chowk a Kanat place for various types of cuisines found there. In Gujarat, Thepla, Dhokla, Khandvi, Handvo, Panki is there. And in Kerala, Stew, Irachi Stew, Tamil Nadu, Atapam, Dosa, Idli, Sambar, Rasam, Pongal, Andaman and Nicobar, they, they have fishes, lobsters and prawns and crab, crabs. They prepare them in their way. From Manipur, they have Eromba, Kobok, Chakoba. Mizoram, a zoo, their zoo, a very special tea. Sikkim has momos which has become street food in India nowadays. Wherever we go, we can find momos very easily. Whereas, but there is thupka, gunruk and seal roti are famous there. In Jharkhand, they have thikwa, pua pitha and barwe ki roti. Bihar comes with hitti chokha and sattu paratha. Uttar Pradesh has various types of kebab and biryanis in which bedmi aloo and kachori is very famous. And Uttarakhand comes with aloo ke gutke, kappa and chingora ki kheel, millets. In Ladakh also momos, tukka, skew are famous because these are the, the regions of Ladakh and Arunachal Pradesh are mainly famous for Chinese cuisines. But this is not the limit. This is not the just. Now from the morning, let's come to the breakfast, which is very famous at various places. Gilda and Kehwa is taken in Jammu Kashmir. Kalari Kulcha is also taken in Kashmir. Paratha Chole Bhature of Punjab. Piaz ki kachori and kalmi vada is watering my mouth still. And hardwo, khamam dhokla, khamam dhokla from Gujarat, masala dosa, neer dosa, bain dosa, puttu kadalakari, appam pathri, pongal, idiyappam, idli from Tamil Nadu. Egg show, pani pitha, khura. Sattu paratha from Bihar. Dal pitha from Bihar again. 
In Uttar Pradesh, there is kachori sabzi, bedmi puri, rai ki sabzi. Whereas in Uttarakhand, mandwe ki roti. And much more. Poha jalebi from Madhya Pradesh. It is very famous and very delicious, I must tell you. But I will have to move ahead. I'm sorry. Here comes the snacks of India. During when we don't have too much of the desire for food, at that time we love to have snacks. Nadir Manji for Kashmir, from Kashmir, Matthi from Punjab, Sohali from Haryana, Alu Lachha from Delhi and Rajasthan's Bhajiya, especially the Bikaneri Bhajiya, Poha Chivda from Maharashtra, Gathiya from Gujarat, Ratlami Sev from Madhya Pradesh, Banana Chips from Kerala, they are very famous nowadays. Maidhal, Keli Chana, Ghum Chawal Roti and Nimki from Bihar. This is not the limit. This is not this. Here we have much. And come to the any snack is or any food is incomplete without chutney or pickles. So here we can see unity in diversity. In terms of pickle as well, Doon Chetin from Kashmir, Piaz Imli Ki Chutney in Punjab, Kachari Ki Chutney in Rajasthan and Lahsan Ki Chutney, which is very spicy and tasty, whereas Gur Kheri no Athanu in Gujarat, Mirchi Thecha in Maharashtra and Coriander Coconut Chutney is, all, is also used in Maharashtra, whereas in South India, uh, also, Alam Pachari, Amba Khatta, Tomato Ki Chutney in Bihar, Lilok Chutney, Chili Chutney, Kordoi Chutney, Tung Tap, Akhuni Chutney, and Hamalcha Rod. Whereas, if we come to the pickles, Kadam Ka Achar in Kashmir, Gajar Muli Ka Achar in Punjab. Kher, Kher ka achar in Rajasthan. Kher is the mango which has to be developed. The, when the flower of mangoes, they develop, they start developing into fruit. Then the small, very small fruit which comes, it is called as Kher. Then Amnu Chudo, Chundo, Kheriche, God Lonche, Miskut, Epilemidi. Chemin Achar, Takali Toku, Amleki Lonji, Ambula Acharo, Ambula is mainly Am, Mango, I think, according to me. Well, I will have to explore more, I think. Then Timla Achar, Dingaruka Achar from Uttarakhand, Pachadanga Achar from Haryana, it is very famous. And you can find it anywhere around. When you, anywhere around yourself when you go through by bus. But this is the street food map of India. Whenever you go anywhere in India, you must enjoy the street food there. The Sidhu in uh, Himachal Pradesh, Bantiki in Uttar Pradesh, Chole Bhature in Punjab, Dahi Samosa in Delhi, Mawa Kachori, Jalebi Fakra in Gujarat, Vada Pao in Maharashtra, Rose Omelette in Damandiu and Goa, and Pazampuri in Kerala, Kohi Pani Yaram, Dahi Bada Aludam, Chikvi Bharta, Smoked pork, keli chana, bamboo shoot fry, and fag pasha, fags shapa, tekeli pitna, and liti chokha from Bihar, duskabara from Jharkhand, and much more. Pedimipuri from Uttar Pradesh is there, but 
and let's move ahead. Now comes when we have food. We have a lot of food that we need to have drinks. Especially in summer, different types of drinks are there. Lassi in Punjab, Chach in Haryana, Pyar Mohabbat ka Sharbat in Delhi, Imli ka Amlana, Komal in Gujarat, Mahuaz Sharbat in Madhya Pradesh, and Salkari in Maharashtra. Panakam in Telangana, Mahua Sharbat is also they are in Chhattisgarh. Ampera Sharbat, Buranj Juice in Uttarakhand, Kinnari Ghanti in Himachal Pradesh, Thandai in Uttar Pradesh, Sattu Ghol in Bihar is there, and much more. But in winters, we have something else. And that is Chai and Coffee. Coffee, I don't need to talk much. But tea, as I think as many states are there, as many types of tea is prepared in India. Along with green tea, black tea, masala tea and all, there is Gurgur Chai in Kashmir, Kehwa is also there in Kashmir, Noon Chai in Kashmir, Gurwali Chai in Punjab, Kangra Tea in Himachal, Beri Nag Chai in Uttar Pradesh, Adrak Wali Chai. Sorry, Peri Nag Chai in Uttarakhand and Adrak Wali Chai in Rajasthan. Nath Dwara Chai, Pukado, Parsi Chai, Cutting Chai of Maharashtra, who knows, who doesn't know about it. Irani Chai, Meter Chai, Suleimani Chai in Kerala, Nilgiri Chai, Karupati Tea and Inji Ikalai Chai in Tamil Nadu. Ronga Shah, smoked tea, and Darjeeling tea, left in of Bengal, Lebuja. But now, now let's come to the monsoon food. Food that is eaten in monsoons. Yaje, Khirpua, Singhali ki sabzi, ghevar, gehu ki bikaneri khichdi of Rajasthan, varsha dodini fool nusha in Gujarat, aluvadi in Maharashtra, potato, theria choghanti, papada, papada vada, and paripu vada in Kerala, ulavaru charu. Amat, Chashila, Chashela, Ragdakari, and Anal Seki Goli, and Mangore of Maharashtra, sorry, Madhya Pradesh, and Mawa Bati, also in Madhya Pradesh. Lingadu ki Sabzi, Gucci, Kandali ka Saag of Uttarakhand, Khasta Kachori of, from Uttar Pradesh. Dekia Zak, Pasa, Lukta, Jada, and when we come to the monsoons, it is impossible to think about rain and to forget about pakoda or bhaji. So there are many types of pakodas famous in India. They are also the snacks, Nandru Monje. Bread pakoda of Punjab, paneer pakoda, milchi vada, dal vada of from Gujarat, kannad bhaji, batata vada, madur vada, pazam pori, vazakkal bhaj bhaji, puli pakodi, piyaji, beguni, shanazhez, nakupi vada, kaat pitha, chingri vada, and much more. But let's move to the fruits. Let's discuss about the foods which are eaten during the winters. Harisa, Shabdeg, and Skew in Kashmir. Teliyama, Mah, 
खट्टा मीच इन कश्मीर इन हिमाचल काफली इन उत्तराखंड निहारी निमोना इन उत्तर प्रदेश गया तिलकुट इन बिहार छुरपी सूप जान समानू ची अलमे बाई मुटिया गदारू गदारू चाट गजक लिट्टी चोखा फ्रॉम मध्य प्रदेश एंड झारखंड उंदियू सुरती पोंग हुर्दा उलाउ चारू and what not this is just still this is just a sim a little part of indian cuisine and after having food we would like to have some sweets and you can see that various types of sweets are famous in india shufta bhave wali barfi in kashmir and tosha as along with that pinni it is very famous in punjab babru from himachal pradesh and mitha as well from himachal pradesh but pal mithai from uttarakhand and kaju katli from uttar pradesh along with petha and balu shahi they have taken they have captured the hearts of many people in india besides that mihi dona sita bhog rasbali kat kot pita shrikhand basundi mohanthal from गुजरात घेवर चूरमा लड्डू फ्रॉम राजस्थान ख्वाबा जलेबी मावा बाटी मोदक फ्रॉम महाराष्ट्र अमर खांड फ्रॉम गुजरात मैसूर पाक फ्रॉम कर्नाटका इलायप्पम श्री विलीपुत्र पक्पल कोवा अरिसेलू bandar ladu and much more and i feel that india has billion plus of people million plus of cuisines thousand plus of tastes but only one feeling and that is unity in diversity and in the end thank you very much